condition of the world, circumstances are always difficult. The whole world is in a condition of strife, conflict, between the forces of truth and light. Wanting to manifest, and the opposition of all that doesn't want to change, which represents in the past what is fixed, hardened, and refuses to go. Naturally, each individual. <coughs> feels his own difficulties uh, is faced by the same obstacle. There is only one way, one way. It is a total, complete, and conditioned what I mean by that is the giving up not only of one's action, work, ambitions, but also of all one's feelings. In the sense that all what you do, all what you are, is exclusively for the divine. So, you feel above the human surrounding reaction. 
not only above them, but protected from them by the wall of the divine grace. Once you have no more desires, no more attachments, once you have given up all necessity of receiving a reward from the human beings, whoever they are, Like knowing that the only reward that is worth getting is that one that comes from the Supreme. And that never fails. Once you give up the attachment to all the exterior beings and things, you are at once free in your heart this presence this force this grace that is always with you and there is no other remedy it's the only remedy for everybody without exception all those who suffer it's the same thing that has to be said all suffering is the sign that the surrender is not taken. Then, when you feel in your pain like that, instead of saying, oh, this one is bad, or this circumstance is difficult, you say, my surrender is not And then you feel the grace that helps you and leads you, and you go. And one day, you imagine that peace that nothing can come. You answer to all the contrary forces, the contrary movement, the attacks, the misunderstanding, the bad will with the same smile that comes from full confidence in the divine script. And that is the only way out. There is no way. This world is a world of conflict, suffering, difficulty, strain. It's made of it. It has not yet changed. It will take some time before changing. And for each one, there is a possibility of getting out. If you lean back on the presence of the Supreme Grace, that is the only way. That I'm telling you since two, three days like that. Constant. Now, But for your work, there is nothing to say you are doing it perfectly well. Exactly as it has to be done, it is all right. You work it quite That is what I wanted to ask. That mm -hmm. is why just I wanted to say this, whether I, this work is... Uh, in any manner needed or not, why should I go on doing this? Excellent. Go on doing it, you do it perfectly well. Don't expect human appreciation. 
because the human beings, they uh, don't know on what ground they can appreciate, and moreover, when there is something that is superior to them, they don't like it. And the first movement is moment. So where to get such a strength to get... Hmm? Where to get such a strength to... It's in you. The divine presence is in you, it is in you. You look for it outside, you think that it is in you. The presence is there. You want the appreciation of the others to get strength, you will never get it. The strength is in you. If you want, you can aspire to what seems to you the supreme good, supreme light, supreme knowledge, supreme love. But it is in you, otherwise you would never be able to contact it. If you go deep enough inside you, you will find it there. Like a flame that is always burning straight up. The messages that I can't write just now, I will send, I keep your paper, I will send the messages, and for your gentleman also, I will send him a card and some blessings. And don't believe that it is so difficult to It is because the look is always turned outside that you don't feel that pain. But if Instead of looking outside for support, you concentrate and you pray inside. It is supreme knowledge to know at each moment what is to be done, the way to do it. And to give all you are, all you do, in order to acquire perfection. And you will see that the support is there, always guiding, showing the way. And if there is a difficulty, instead of wanting to fight, you hand it over. Hand it over to the Supreme Wisdom to deal with it. To deal with all the bad wills, all the misunderstandings, all the bad reactions. If you surrender completely, it's no more your concern. It's the concern of the Supreme who takes it up and knows better than anybody else what is to be done. The only way out, only way out. Well, I keep that I send you. 
one thing is whatever i do there that is also not liked by my own people no and uh, your and own people are all mixed up by everybody so and then uh, uh, but my feeling is so strong not only strong in that way but it is as clear as daylight as if i am just sitting in your presence mm. that i do not do anything myself this is such a great clear experience to me from all these years that whatever is being done by me it is being done by a some force and not by me at all and it gets it done but then the huh? you expect the world to understand that no but they may not It's understand impossible. i don't want any credit for that but, but you see the obstacles they, and the uh, the if you consider that that i can understand and know then you have my full support i never told you that you were doing wrong did i no once we all you must understand that unless people are too yogi out of the ego completely surrendered to the supreme they can't understand how could they, they see with the all the exterior eyes and knowledge they see exterior things and the appearance they don't see the inside when we have stopped expecting appreciation from the outside that is from the human being we have no reason to complain they appreciate so much better for them they don't appreciate it doesn't matter it's their own look we do the things not to please them we do the things because we feel that that is to be them i've never expected appreciation mother perhaps things are coming to come compel you to take up that position because that is a liberation that is a true liberation i do not not from ego but i i am a sadhu by nature i don't need anything at all that's all right but you must not need also the appreciation of your own friend with all my failings and weaknesses I don't need anything at all. I don't need any anything. Then you can't suffer. Because the only thing you need that is the support of the divine and you have it. Then you can't suffer. But I'm suffering very much. Yes, there is a conflict in the view. One part of your consciousness knows, but there is still one part that is the slave of the serpent.
perhaps all that has been coming upon you for the supreme and the total liberation. And if you take it like the expression of the grace, you will see the result. Peace, a peace that nothing can disturb, perfect equanimity, and a strength that never fails. Take it as a new birth today, a new life that is beginning.